the sheriff's office. Hello, this call may be monitored for quality assurance. Uh, my name is Garrett, I'm calling from New Hampshire, and um, am, is it true that the Sheriff's Department in Dinwiddie County has detained a truck from a Mr. James Cleveland? I don't know who I'm speaking to by phone, and I'm not going to answer that, sir. Okay, well my name is Garrett Ian, you can consider me a member of the press, and I'm inquiring as to why it is that your department detained a vehicle that belongs to a business owner who was passing through your uh, county. Sir, I'm not a press release agent, and I'm not going to release Okay, well, it sounds like you're covering up for something because you work for the public. Your money is stolen from taxpayers to pay your salary, and you can't even answer a question. I'm going to debate with you on that, okay? Well, you don't have to debate. All you need to do is be an honest individual, a good human being, and say why it is that you stole someone's truck. Okay, I have another call coming in. We didn't steal anyone's truck, sir. Um, yes, you did. Before you make accusations, okay? Could I speak to your superior, okay. please? Ooh. Oh! Time to call back. Uh, they can't do that. So, well, oh, I'm gonna get Rich to do it. Too. Hold on. I don't know. If another call's coming in and this one's it. not providing any information for anything that they need, they yeah, probably could. could the they one. probably could hang out for that other call. Um, because you could always just call back. But if they're just hanging out to hang out, I mean, Dick. Get the cat like the exact same position. Yeah. Cats are cool like that. That was awesome the way you handled that shit. That was amazing. Hey, may I ask who I'm speaking to? Thank you, May I ask who I'm speaking with? Jones. Jones. Thank you, Jones. Uh, my name is Garrett Ian. This call may be monitored for quality assurance. And I'm calling from New Hampshire to determine why it is that a truck was confiscated from a small business owner in Dinwiddie County today. Sir, the only thing I can tell you is under investigation, and that's all I can tell about it. Well, if it's under investigation, you could tell me what by what probable cause your agency has detained the vehicle. You must have Sir, articulable... I'm in, I'm, in a I'm in a different space from where it's been investigated, and I really don't know. Okay, well, it sounds like the people that you work with are doing some very shady things and abusing the rights of people who are traveling through your county. And as a human being, that offends me. Um, I wish that people could just travel freely and not be detained for no reason. Uh, Mr. Cleveland is an honest individual, a good individual, a hardworking individual who wouldn't harm anybody, and you have no reason to be stealing his property. We didn't steal his property. Okay, well, you just call it something else, and it becomes something magically else. But really, if I took a truck from uh, your department, if I just went there and said, oh, I think there might be drugs in here and took it, you guys would call that theft. It would be a crime. Um, you'd hunt me down, and you'd throw me in a cage. However, your organization seems to do it with impunity, and I can't understand that. Sir, like I told you, it's an investigation, and I can't go into it. Okay, well, I hope that if you have a conscience as an individual that you will look into why it is that your coworkers are stealing people's property when I'm sure there's people out there that are actually hurting people, actually causing problems, and you're wasting your time harassing hardworking, honest people. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I hope you grow a conscience.